Oh, hey, what's up? I, I didn't really know you were there. I, I wasn't, that wasn't what you thought it was. That that wasn't, I promise, I was, uh, uh, no, what, that wasn't like a, one of the, the TikTok dances. I, it wasn't. Um, yeah, it's Kragen. We got a new Hero's Journey. We're live. It is Tuesday, um, January 19th, 2021. We got a couple things going on, y'all. I did write down a few notes. We have a few notes. A few notes here. A couple, couple uh, items I'd like to discuss. A couple uh, items from the Amazon. My best friend, the Amazon Fairy. Amazon Fairy delivered some more items. Um, I stole that from someone who made it up, so don't think that that's my making the Amazon fairy uh, comment. But yeah, uh, real quick, I just wanted to say I hope everyone's doing well. 2021's kind of popping off pretty hard right now. Hope everyone's good. Couple experiments here. So with the Sony A7 III, aka my best friend, we're doing a little, little, lip, little, lip, little widescreen stuff photo lover 337. Uh, we're doing a7 III, boom. So we're doing boom, which is pretty funny to think that, um, like what if all of us on our, on our fancy cameras now are going to start shooting like for the iPhone, but I was doing some experiments and I posted a video earlier and then I went pretty, I went viral, go home viral, go home viral. I freaking love it, dude. I love going viral. There's nothing better. And the video, you know, was shot this way and dude, it was sick cause I literally took the video from the camera, A7S III, did the little like uh, uh, image editing app with Sony. You can just send the send the, the the image or the video in this case straight from the camera to your phone. Like you just take your phone and you put it next to the camera and it'll like QR code it and it'll send the footage. And with the A7 III, I, I did that but it would really de-resolutionize it pretty bad. And it would also, I haven't checked the quality of this other, this newer stuff I've been sending, but I gotta tell you, um, I gotta tell you that uh, when I did this, one second, give me, like, give me one sec for this mic placement. Using the Sennheiser Love, Sennheiser Love. Hopefully we're not popping out too much. Z girl, what's up? Um, I have an eye for how I was talking about. Crap, what was I talking about, y'all? What was I talking about? Oh, yeah, sending footage from your camera. So my A7S III, my new best friend, you can send your footage or photos from the camera right to your phone. And last night I was experimenting, and I sent a 4K 120 frames per second, which right now the Sony A7 III is like the only thing that can do that without like going out to a, to a uh, external recorder, all internal, shot it on 124K with the crappiest lighting, handheld, the horrible conditions, high ISO, etc. It was the little plant video I posted that's going viral, the little plant video. Just a quick little boom, sent it from my camera, and this was shooting in a mode which is called SNQ mode on the Sony, which is like, it shoots it real quick, slow and quick S and Q it shoots it quickly and it puts it into slow-mo in the camera. So you don't have to do that in the editing stages, but usually it's shot at a lower M bit. So usually it's looks kind of crappier and it doesn't record audio. So the, those are the two caveats, but I really like doing it sometimes cause it makes it so easy to just send, to just shoot it, see the slow-mo. You don't have to edit it later. It really just ends up being like really nice, really great. I wonder if my levels are a little louder. I'm gonna turn the music down a teeny bit. So I'm nervous. I'm nervous I'm blowing out right now. You know, blow out. I had an old film uh, coordinator, film guy, and like us PAs, Sh shout out Corey in Dallas, Matt Holland, all y'all. Remember Sam Lucchese? We'd be hanging out. And, and like we go to lunch and then after lunch, you'd be like, oh, I gotta use the bathroom. And you'd be like, are you gonna blow out? <laughs> like ask you for go take a crap. Like, are you gonna blow out? <laughs> it, was like, it was a great, it was one of my first bigger jobs it was for the Devil's Ride. It was shot in San Diego when I lived in San Diego. It was about this biker show. It was pretty cool. It's on Discovery, uh, Devil's Ride. 
so check that out. But it was funny how you're gonna blow out. <laughs> like so on PC, he was the best. Sam Lucchese, you're the man. Thank you for introducing me to Hollywood and just being an awesome guy. He's been in the industry forever. Hopefully he's still alive. I mean, he was an older big guy, looked like Santa Claus. Everyone loved him, he was the man. But um, the story's really gone onto a bunch of pieces. I can't remember where I'm at. But, so take the footage off the camera and then you put it on your phone and you look at the footage and I was like, oh my God, that footage looks amazing, amazing. So even if it did like de-resolution it, like made it worse and smaller to go on your phone or made it into a proxy, what's up, Liz? Made it into a proxy, I couldn't tell because it looked so great. And then I literally took that, didn't edit it, didn't do nothing to it and put it straight onto like Instagram and it just, that process was so easy and smooth and the footage looked so great. Even on the a7 III, when I would do stuff like that, like it would, you wouldn't be able to connect the phone. It'd be a big pain in the ass. It like wouldn't work well. You're like, come on, dude. But now this thing, you turn on the image editing app, image mobile app, you QR it up, Q QR code it up, and bam, it's just like perfectly, um, does it perfectly. And then you can go right onto your social media, right onto your TikToks and you know, and I, it just works so good. And that stuff for me makes me wanna shoot more, makes me wanna create more, and it allows me to create more. Cause it's just the easy use. use. So that's pretty wild. So I'm, that's, that's gonna really up my game. That's gonna make it more fun to do like these little reels. Just go shoot a little, cause shooting the slow-mo 4K 120 on the a7S III, it's just so much fun and it looks so great. And we've been waiting for it for so long. You just wanna be able to use it. But a lot of times B-roll slow-mo, it's like it goes over top of stuff. It's not really a standalone thing. Unless in this case, you're just shooting the little mini thing for TikTok or Instagram or just a quick little 10 to 15 second fancy little fun video. It's perfect. You go shoot a little, your little plant, you throw it on your phone, you add 10 seconds of music, bam, you're going viral. So that's awesome. Super stoked. If this vol volume's a little loud, I'm sorry, y'all. This mic is like very sensitive. On this, oh my God, so serendipitous, synchronicity. This is the song I used in the last video I posted that I was just talking about. So he's an awesome God and thank you. All right, let's move on to my, my points here. It says I have some points. All right, first off, Amazon. I know, I, well, whatever. We all know, we, I sorry I shop at Amazon, y'all. I know it's a global corporation that little kids got to beg our stuff or something, but this is made in the USA. This is, uh, I got a bunch of these, bunch of these. Everyone, you know what these are if you're a surfer. Oh yeah, that cool cold. This is all I use, y'all, the sticky bumps. Gold. So I got a bunch of these I'm set now for the next month or two. Another hot scoring item. A little bit of organic raw meal. Shout out Dan Ledoux. Dan Ledoux, I got you on this stuff. This stuff's amazing. It's amazing. <laughs> oh my God, I'm turning into an Instagram influencer. This is just amazing. I do it every day with my almond milk. But uh, this stuff really is great, guys. Like, And it's good just to have this in your cupboard for when the zombie apocalypse comes and you have like a little bit of just protein powder. It's all organic, all whole foods, no soy. Don't, don't eat soy if you're a guy or if you're a girl, but it's in so much stuff, but it's not good, but it's cheap and easy to put into foods and like fill, it's like a filler, common filler. But for guys, uh, Alex, soy. I know you've been drinking those soy lattes, you gotta stop. Um, also, I'm gonna check my notes. Uh, ordered a new camera strap. Pretty exciting, because right now I'm using this crappy uh, Sony one. It's the worst camera strap ever that comes with the camera. Just because I, don't tell anyone this, but I dropped the camera already. It was only from like here. It was from like here to the table. Like a one foot, 12 inch drop but it hit this, hit the little side and it scuffed up a teeny bit, but like I was taking off this mic and just, and it scared the crap out of me. Cause this was like, I don't know, had the camera for a week. 
So luckily, you know, it's all insured, it's all good now, and um, I just like having a strap, but I like having a system that you can take it on and off. This is just locked on the camera. No bueno, not stoked on that. So Peak Design, everyone's seen them. It's those two little dangly things from the camera, little red and black balls that dangle from each side, and you snap in the, uh, the strap so you can snap in and out of the camera, which is great. And it's just great because like I love just going out and about and I rarely, when I'm out and about, I want to have a, a, a strap. And this is great because you can neck, put it around your neck, shoulder, you can like sling it around your chest and then you can still put it on your tripod. You know, you get to the tripod, you put it on, you want the strap off, you just unclip it. So that's awesome because when I'm out and about, I don't, when I see people just holding their camera and they don't have like a wrist strap connected or have it on their neck or just some kind of, I'm, I'm scared. That's scary. And even if you have your stuff insured, you'd rather not have to send it in or you rather not fall even if it is insured. So that was, that, so luckily that's coming in soon. So I'm very excited about that. Um, but yeah, y'all, that's kind of all I got. I just wanted to kind of check in on a few new items I got. I wanted to keep this under 15. So we're gonna see, um, we're gonna see how this video comes out with shooting it horizontal. Horizontal, no, shooting it vertical and then going straight into the IGTV land and seeing just how this is gonna, this could be the new setup for Heroes Journeys. Um, it is a little awkward to use cause it's like, so I'm shooting it like this and like the flippy screens up and it's working, but and it's kind of all like now everything's sideways so I'm clicking on the back to do stuff like this I have to like kind of guess where stuff is and then I'm guessing like oh is it, it just kind of gets all combobulated it's the a7 III this is my my prior love this is my first love or sorry this is my second love my first love was the GH5 one or the GH1 the GH5 one GH5 one first love which you guys all know, I'm pretty sure. And then A7 III, Second Love. It just wants to focus on me so bad. And now the third love is, I'm shooting with it right now. Um, so yeah guys, just wanted to chime in, quick vid. Hope everyone's well during the vid. Again, um, this audio is a little loud, I apologize. I didn't want to change it halfway through and I might even attempt to do the old send this right from the camera to the phone and upload it and we're gonna see how that looks so all right guys we're out of here thanks for cracking in photography lover thanks for uh staying in the whole time appreciate you Alex Z girl Liz all y'all appreciate y'all take care and uh peace